Appalachian Wireless has some of the best data rates in wireless on our plans, and not to mention an amazing deal on one of our hottest smartphones. But that's all the time I have to explain. See store for details. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless. In less than a week, the streets of Pikeville will be packed with hillbillies of all walks of life. And the Pikeville Police is requesting those hillbillies leave their fur babies at home. No dogs, leashed or unleashed, are allowed in the areas of the city where Hillbilly Day's activities are happening. Pikeville PD says it's a safety matter for festival goers and pets. Everybody's shoulder to shoulder. There's just too much traffic, foot traffic in town for people to have their dog on a leash or even be packing it. You know, we, we don't want to take the chance of somebody stepping on a dog's foot and then just snapping at them, something it normally wouldn't do but you know, it's just defending itself. So we come up with a no animal policy during Hillbilly Days. If you're packing one, you got one on a leash, typically we won't come to you and we'll ask you to leave with the animal. It's just not worth us having to go through all the dog bites and things of that nature with that going on down in town. There is, of course, one notable exception to the rule. We do allow service dogs for people that has to have a service dog with them. We're still gonna approach you, we're still gonna ask you about the dog, you prove to us and show us that it is your service dog, that's fine. You know, those dogs have went through extensive training and they're used to being around people and they interact with people real well. So, you know, that's just something that that person has to have. So your normal home pets, you can leave at home during the festivities, you know, and come down and enjoy it and go back home to your animal. Hillbilly Days begins Thursday, April 20th. In Pikeville, Chris Anderson, EKB News.